A section on the Salah of a Sick Person A sick person is pardoned from attending the congregational prayer. Furthermore, if standing during the prayer would increase his sickness, he can pray sitting. If he is unable to pray sitting, then while laying on his side. This is due to what the Prophet ﷺ said to Imran ibn Hussein, in the meaning of which, pray standing if you are unable, then while sitting if you are unable, then on your side. Narrated by Imam Bukhari. Moreover, if it becomes difficult for one person to perform each of the individual salawats at the prescribed time, then he can combine between Duhr and Asr and between the evening prayers, Maghrib and Isha, at the time of either one of those two. A section on the salah of the one who is traveling. Similarly, it is permissible for someone who is traveling to combine between Dhuhr and Asr and between Maghrib and Isha at the time of either one of the two either by bringing forward the latter or by delaying the former. Furthermore, it is sunnah for him to show under prayer that have four units to two units. He is also permitted to break his fast during Ramadan, and he must make them up after Ramadan. A section on Salatul Khawf, prayer at time of fear. It is permissible to perform Salatul Khawf in any matter which the Prophet wasallam prayed it, one of which is mentioned in the narration of Salih ibn Khawat, on the authority of those who prayed Salat al Khawf with the Prophet وسلم, on the day of Al Riqa'ah. One group prayed with him while another group faced the enemy. He prayed one raka'ah with the ones who were with him, then he remained standing while they finished by themselves. Then they left, the line facing the enemy. While the other group came, then he prayed with them the remaining rak'ah. Then he remained seated while they finished by themselves. Then he made a slim with them, agreed upon. If the fear becomes too intense, they can perform salah while walking or riding, facing the direction of the qibla or something else, and they make gestures with their hands, head for rakuah and sujood. Similarly, Anyone who fears for himself should pray according to his ability and do everything that he needs to escape, etc. The Prophet wasallam said in the meaning of which, If I command you with something, then do as much of it as you are able to do so, agreed upon.